In this video, you'll be introduced to the Arduino board. The Arduino is a microcontroller platform that consists of both hardware, the Arduino board, and software, the Arduino IDE. That's an Arduino Uno board. It's a circuit board with a microcontroller on it. This microcontroller is the ATmega 328P and it is the brain of the Arduino. You can program it to interact with a physical world like control an LED or activate a motor. The Arduino can also be used to tell what's going on in the world. For example, you can read data from sensors, like this ultrasonic sensor that measures distance, this PR motion sensor that detects motion, or this temperature and humidity sensor. To tell your Arduino what to do, you send a set of instructions to the microcontroller on the board. This set of instructions is called a sketch, and you write your sketches on a software called Arduino IDE, which you're going to explore in a future video. Both the Arduino hardware and software are open source. This means that both can be used freely and adapt as needed. For example, Anyone can copy the Arduino design and sell their own Arduino boards. And that's what many companies did. So, you'll see many Arduino clones, or also known as Arduino compatible boards out there, like this same smart Arduino clone. The Arduino clones are cheaper and work the same way as the official Arduino, so you shouldn't have any problem using a compatible clone. There are several Arduino boards, the most common is the Arduino Uno, and that's the one we're going to use in this course. There are other models like the Arduino Nano, Pro Mini, Mega and Wemilanov, for example. All these boards work in a similar way, but each one has different specifications. Some of them offer more pins, others have a faster processor, etc. It is worth taking a look at the Arduino boards page so that you have an idea of the Arduino boards available and their differences. There are also these boards called shields. You mount them on top of the Arduino to give it extra capabilities. Here we have several examples of shields. A data logging, Ethernet, TFT display, GSM, motor driver and LCD shields. Compatible Arduino shields have pins that align perfectly on the Arduino top header pins, as you can see. There are also a wide variety of sensors and modules you can use with your Arduino to make great projects in an easy way. You'll see how to use some of them along the course. In the next videos, you'll explore the Arduino hardware in more detail and the Arduino IDE software. 